So I'm gonna play the game three, post post game post sideboard, uh my hand is uh, yeah, it's reasonable. I don't see any reason to roll again. Sam, you good? Uh yeah, yeah, I'm gonna keep this. Um I feel like these two cards here are what makes me able to keep it, despite the fact that it's you know, it's a bit light. But yeah, we're gonna keep. Come okay. down, good. Alright. Um I actually do sort of want to get this out of the way. I want to see what's going on in Sam's. Uh, and I'm going to find six. Okay. Um, this is a hand that's not very good against the list. <laughs> We're going to take the divination. Um, I think cutting cutting you off access to cards is basically what we want to do. Yep. I have a three uh, I want to send your turn. Your vault out. Mm -hmm. um, play this now, it gives him the opportunity to detention sphere it, but I think I want to do it anyway. Um, it's more mana efficient and it makes him spend the detention sphere if he wants to use his jazz. So I'm going to play Pithy Needle and name jazz. Oh, yeah. So it's just a, an intentional one for one trade there, basically. That's what happened. Okay. Nice. <laughs> uh, activate Mutable, yep. attack for two, add an edge. Yep. Swamp, dress. Jess, Jess, Jess. Hmm, interesting. Um, because I've got the Mutable, so you can't really activate Jason go, uh, to go down immediately next turn, so he's going to have to push it off. Um, if he plays one, so I'm going to take the revelation. Yes. I think I'm happy to go down with the first one here. Alright, so it's awesome to commit to land. That's a good, good set of cards. Um, hmm. Two cards here. Uh, I mean, yeah, there's not much I can do to make it not take two cards. See you next time. Cool. Yeah, there's no way I'm not taking two cards in any situation. Could be the best, best, could be the best spell in my deck against uh, two lands that I want to take on. Uh, as far as land drop the turn is concerned, um, this is actually a bit of a decision. Which one I want to do here. Um, look, I'm not assuming that I need that color, so I'm just gonna I'm gonna run the new bulb out. I think it's just better here. Yeah, okay. Interesting decision this turn. Like, do I? Divination, and just wait, or do I Jace, and uh, with my Jace, I can either take it up or, put it, or, or push it down. Uh, pushing it down obviously just condemns it to death, whereas taking it up condemns it to death by Hero's Downfall, but it's really, really sweet if he doesn't have Hero's Downfall, like really sweet. Um, but if he doesn't have much action, if he inclined to say he probably has a Hero's Downfall in his hand, maybe amongst like at least one other land. Um, so he, his hand could like have, trying to read my mind now. Yeah, I am trying to read his mind here, but based <laughs> on the way he's played this game, um, he hasn't gone and just like shoved a thread at me. But he hasn't really had an opportunity to play like desecration demon yet or anything like that, which I'm kind of okay with. Um, think of this situation: I'm going to play Jason Ticket off and see what happens. And it's also instead of that I have my land drop this turn anyway. So it's your turn soon. All right, cool. Hopefully it doesn't downfall me and then like thought season. It's had to be devastating. If only. Yeah. Um it's gonna be nice for I get to you know tick down JCP attacks with both my guys anyway and defend nicely. 
I think this is a good spot to run this out, and then I can just do that, uh, get my filter on, so, desecration daemon, and then Sparrowland, Sparrowland, sure, no worries, this is something that we want, yeah, alright. I'm going to minus two here, I think. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. I could be right to go up again. And just detentions here is uh, demon and cast divination. As soon as entire turn killing Jace, if I don't take it down. If I, if I do take it down anyway. This ain't good for us in the long run. So we'll be up four cards. Assuming pretty nobody. Let's see what's going on at the top of the deck. I'm going to go up, I'm going to cast Tension Sphere on this, and I'm going to play Divination. Okay, I've got three cards in here? Yeah. Alright, cool. Alright, so we know what we're doing this turn. Yeah. Um, just being on six means that uh, we can't answer it with Muta Bolts, even if we wanted to. Um, so since I had this uh, use unknown information, I'm going to pick it up and you guys can look at it. Look, it's not really much of a choice. Um, I'm just going to run this out. Uh, might as well keep forcing him into action. Um, the moment he ticks Jace down, it's in a lot of trouble. So, forcing him into that spot is not terrible. So, yeah. I'll run it out of the Yep. Okay. Your turn. Right, this is playing reasonably nicely into what we've got going on here. I think the first thing I need to do is I'm going to take this chase down because it's time to get some more cards. Muta Vault, Muta Vault, Seeds of Revelation. Yeah, the Muta Vault, so this is a question. I'll take Seeds of Revelation. Uh, yeah, there's no reason to give him more cards. <laughs> this, is, this is particularly fun because I'm just going to play Fifth and Needle and then Muta Vault. That's <laughs> right. And then we get a Supreme Verdict. Okay, yeah. yeah. Alright, sometimes I've got all the answers. Yeah. <laughs> I'll play my method down to pass. Alright, sure. Alright, well, I'm going to untap. Yep. It's a good place to start. Yeah. Hopefully he doesn't sink like me here, or address me, or seize me, or kill me. That's possible. Just reach over the table. Yeah. Rip his throat out. Okay. Um, yeah, yeah I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to lead off with the breed the bones. Alright, so I get it. So, yeah. Let's have a look. Spray two. I don't want to hit those. So yeah. let's get two random cards. Yeah. Not, not unhappy with that. Right um, I go down to 16. Yeah. yeah. And you sync like to me. I'm going to lead off with a dress. Okay. Do you move a revelation? You know what? I'm going to take the revelation. This is interesting. Yeah. Very interesting decision. Revelation. Huh? Uh, and I'm going to read the bones again. Sure. That's a pretty good turn for you. Storm 3. Yeah. Um, yeah. We definitely want this more than we want this, but we don't have to make that choice, so we're just going to draw both. Cool. Right. Right. <laughs> Keep in Take chase down? Mm-hmm. <laughs> sure you don't want the one? Mm. It's tempting. Tempting. Yeah. I suppose it's your turn. Silent. Take the tension sphere. Mm -hmm. um, Someone twelve. We know it's not working with much. Um, we basically wanted to want to force Mitchell class, but it's going to have to find an answer. Uh, normally, I'd be trying to resolve this when I knew that he was um, sort of tapped out of counters, but. I think in this board situation, we want him to have to use his jazz. Um, and obviously it's weak in some situations, depending on what, what's on top of his deck, but we're going to have to do it anyway. Yeah. So, Daniel. Sure. All right. Yes, sir. I cast Divination. It's about as good a draw as you possibly have. Oh. Yep. Yeah, okay. One, two. Camera send those cards. Sorry, yeah, camera send those cards. When you scry, also. Yep. I'll come out with them and 
And I think I'm gonna pass here. Okay. Sure. Yep. We're gonna lead off with this, just see if we can have a look at his hand. Um, because that's pretty good for us. So we're gonna try and read this. Sure. Um, look, we've already got one of these, we don't want another one, so we're actually just going to bottom both of these. That was pretty sweet. I got a 10. Yep. Let's sync like them. Yep. I have the verdict and I have the rest of Okay, so he's making you choose here, <laughs> basically. Um, so I can kill the Jace and then get Verdicted, or I can take the Verdict, keep the Sin Collector, keep the Demon on top of my deck. I've got backup threats, so I'm not really worried about the Verdict. I want to take the uh, Zerus Charm and cut him off cards. Yep, take the Zerus Charm, uh, Exile, by the way, and kill Jace. True. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> okay. Oh, verdict. Surprising. I'll play it. Didn't surprising go on. What did you draw, Patty? Sorry. <laughs> uh, draw for the turn? Yep. Not the world's worst card. Uh, don't know. Mm -hmm. Like that zombie. He's got nothing. So. Uh, what are we gonna do? Play three. Underworld connections. connections up a swamp. Yeah. Definitely not a mutable. Yeah. And because we already made a land drop this turn, we're just gonna say pass. Okay. Play Ratchet Bomb. Ratchet Bomb resolves. Sit in. Okay, we've got to play one left for a card. Yeah. Yeah, well, we're pretty much back in Drone Revelation here at some point in time. But, uh, unfortunate string of spells when we've heard. Yeah, um, we said words, yeah, yeah, but basically my draw was really fueled by all those uh, those um, read the bones. Yeah, and just sort of showing off how good that card actually is, even though we haven't seen much of it in this format yet. Uh, I'm gonna play a Temple of Silence yeah. right up, just get some more information. Yeah, uh, that's not a card we wanted. So I'm gonna take this out. Okay, all right. So I'm gonna hit you for three. Hit three. Uh, you're online. You go to 15. Yeah, I've done a lot of damage to myself this game. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna go to 8. Yep, that's all. Sure, card. Sweet. 10 plus. And Cody. Again, just playing land. No point bluffing here. Make a revelation as big as humanly possible. It's very unprofessional. Very unprofessional. I have to call you back. <laughs> Parents. <laughs> Just because it's Christmas. Um, Alright, I'm going to hit you three. Take three. We can run this out, but there's no real need. So he's going to have to find an answer for this and. We want him to stick to tick his Ratchet Bomb up a bit before we do it. Um, we know we're going to lose the connections and the life band zombie to it, but it's still, uh, it's still worth it in a lot of ways. You understand that I can't really cut Akron for three because I have two defenders for the player. Paddy just pointed out that I'm a bad player. Uh, <laughs> and that would actually be really sorry if you did do that, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so it's pretty safe. Um, in that case, it's even worse to run this out, so we're not going to. Um, okay, pack to say, yeah, no pack rate. <laughs> I got a pack rate. Yeah. Um, uh, maybe he kills himself with underworld connections. <laughs> it's plausible. Um, yeah, at some point you're gonna have to draw a Sphinx's Rev, so. Yeah. Um, hmm. Actually, yeah, no, we do need the backup threat. Uh, there's not much point in playing at lands at this point, though, except to play around a giant sink of hate. So, we're not gonna do that. So, we're gonna pass it. Mm -hmm. The pack right number of counters. Patty is ready. Right, Go. Alright, draw for turn. Yep. Not a great card, but we're going to use the scroll. Mm -hmm. 
that is something we're potentially in the market for, but I'm not sure it's actually something we need here. We are mainly looking for backup threads at this point. Something that's going to get us out if you have to just fix this rep for a lot. Yep, go to six. Sure. That's our card. All right, we're going to hit the three. Yep, go to nine. Sure. And I need to make any actions. So go to I'm going to cycle to the gym. Sure. Two things. Draws the hand penny. Sorry. Are you going to draw? Mm -hmm. uh, because we've got such a density of these, and uh, like these three cards here, you can actually pull it to buy one. Um, check that he doesn't have another as his charm, and he's just going to set us back by a turn. So I'm going to duress. It's a single blade. Cool. Um, attack the three. Yep. Go to six. Uh, no need to draw this card yet because there's nothing that we play. So you have to. Go. Hey, buddy. Sorry. Go for it. Okay. Go to five. Short card. Drop the turn. <coughs> Good uh, Same as last last turn. We can fire something off because there's really no downside in it. I'm gonna see collector. Extension sphere. Okay. So I know I should have played this on my turn because like targeting his life zombie. But I had this like a uh, intricate plan which involves me taking this up, giving him a desecration demon back, and then eating him again. I don't think it's very good. <laughs> Neither do I. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> All right. So given that you got that, I'm just going to take it. Okay, let's let's just go ahead. No worries. I got a three. Got a three. Right. You also got a three. Yep. No worries. And we're just going to stay the course and pass. I'm going up. Okay. Sure. Stay the course, maybe. You're doing super. <laughs> Good. I think the best chance of winning the game is, is, is just sitting around like this. I'm gonna give it, get another redraw of this. Yep. Card's good. Thanks for you. Yeah. Alright, declare attacks. Go for it. Close this. Yeah, the draw last us go. Uh, yeah, I'll draw. I'll draw. Okay. 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 Go on. Sweet, so my things for you to die. These things come out. supposed to come back. Yeah. I'm going to name. Uh, I want Jason or Elspeth. Um. Uh, hmm. Yeah. Obviously, got more Jasons, uh, but Elspeth is worse for me. Um. Let's just go with Jace. Okay. Jace Architect the Thought, not Jace the Real Maniac. Uh, and we're going to see Collector. Takes from Yeah, Sweet. Um, and because there's no reason not to, finally. Well, your turn. <laughs> so there's no right. guarding against the top of the deck. So there is now. I do it for 10. So again, 10. I draw 10. Yeah, uh, six, uh, sixteen. Sixteen. One, yeah, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So, I really want to get this guy to play. I'm going to play with two of them. Sweet. So I got eight cards in hand. Mm -hmm. I'm good this guy. Yeah. One. So, gave us a little bit of breathing room. <laughs> because you don't know. Alright, no worries, I'll get eight. Yeah, that's, that's me not having a proper clock on. Um, anyway. So, don't play land yet? How many cards do you have? 
Seven. Oh, that was great. <laughs> hmm. Don't really have any choices here, so I'm just going to go to player attackers. You put the game on top of your deck. Sorry, I think I'll get my deck. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you take two? Yes. This is six. Um, look, what I want to do here is I want to, to force him into swiping the board. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to play a pack rat. Dissolve pack rat. Scry. Huh. Okay, that didn't resolve. I am going to try a desecration. It also gets dissolved. And she's out of counters now. So, um, happy to drop this. Bye bye. Let's not say that that lamp is open. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not actually happy about that. That's something. Do you have a land in your hand? Yes. Okay. Okay. You can play it. Yeah, that's fine. Play land. No. Go. Thankfully, Luke Moke will be coming to you with an article about how you meant to represent that. That's exactly. That's one of the things I brought up. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's ridiculous. Hmm. Now, like, what? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We're on video, so we're talking about that. Connections up as well. Sure. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna. Yep, good man. He has some better zoom in practice, it's good. I just. Yeah. You need it to give you that drive. It's sort of annoying though, because it's like, you know, like. It's, it's known information versus not known information, right? Yeah. Well, like, whether you have a blue source open or not. Yeah, it's it's like, it's like, my mind has a tap like below it. I just couldn't say. Yeah. Now you can watch a video and see where it was. If it was stuck well, I, mean, I, I don't, I don't, yeah. <laughs> right, I'm going to revolution. Given this isn't a competitive match, I, like, I will normally confirm, confirm that. And people should do that as yeah. well. I should really confirm. So, 3, 6, 9, 11? Yep. And this is how the match is confirmed. Alright, can I consider that? You, you want to see? Yeah, I want to see. Um, yeah, I have an exotic, but it's better girls, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. Yeah, I can't do that. 